coastal charm, abundant art, the past around every corner. There's a deep sense of history which is embodied in the architecture and the, the landscape around us. It's an attractive town or small city on multiple different levels. People love the balance between it's small enough, but it's not too large. Newburyport today remains as appealing as ever for the same reasons. A mix of old and new, wonderfully walkable, the water only blocks away wherever you are. And at only an hour away or so from Boston, pretty much a perfect day trip. People talk all the time about the quality of life here. This is a walkable community. One way to enjoy Newburyport's walkability is to stroll on the Clipper City Rail Trail, a three plus mile pedestrian path connecting the train station to the Harbor Walk. Jordy Vining is one of the project's master planners. It's almost like you're moving through outdoor rooms and some rail trails, you're all just going through the forest. But ours, we have multiple different sort of neighborhoods and rooms we're working through. We also have sculpture and other elements to make it particularly interesting. Including a few obscure history lessons along the way. This is a great old historic photograph of this locomotive that came down the embankment right here. Right so this is spot. literally right here. This is literally right here in 1873. That was a bad day in Newburyport. No mishaps this day, fortunately, as our rail trail adventure steams ahead. It encompasses the shipbuilding pass as we go through the old shipyards, but the railroad was a big shift for Newburyport, bringing in industrialization. Tired of walking? So, Jordy, I gotta say, this is a first on so many levels today. Not only walking the rail trail, I have never seen a bench anywhere with a footrest. Yeah. Whose brilliant idea was this? Well, I'll, 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 was it I'll yours? take credit for that. It is this my is your idea? idea. Yeah. So, oh uh, my God, I'm in the presence of genius. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Scandinavian bench. They called it the Cajun. They designed it for exactly what we're doing, looking out at the water with one's feet up. They're remarkably rare. Seating option B, appropriately called peace offering. There's a hawk on the other side oh. and then a dove on this side. Oh, and wow these hands, which are really benches. This is a bronze piece which people are supposed to be able to sit together and yeah. have a chat. Um, this is perfect for pandemic seating. <laughs> that's you're perfectly right. safe. You don't even need the six feet. That's right. Or if you're in an argument with your spouse. And you... <laughs> One thing you can argue about, Newbury Ports appeal as a day trip destination. Downtown is full of shops and historic sites, the Market Square Historic District features the city's famous federal-style architecture, and the city has become a foodie destination, too. Newburyport has become a, a little hub in the region just to go to restaurants. Siri Kieser co-owns Sea Level Oyster Bar right in the heart of Newburyport's historic downtown. Us being right here on the water and overlooking this beautiful park and the river, you can't ask for anything better than sitting out here on this back deck in the front patio. For seafood lovers, the menu at Sea Level Restaurant is next level with dishes like the baked seafood pie. Lobster, shrimp, scallops, mussels, sitting on top of a bed of mashed potatoes, mixed veg, and a classic sherry cream sauce. Can't decide on surf or turf? Try both. The Sea Level Burger is topped with fresh fried clams and a special sauce, but we came for the zipline tacos. And now with the social distancing, you can't go wrong of placing your order, grabbing your taco out of your bucket and walking away and sitting on this beautiful park overlooking the water. Now we're talking. So that's it. That's it. This is great. You, uh, you include the utensil. Absolutely. With the tacos. You know? Fantastic. Shovel it right in my mouth. A perfect meal on a perfect day for a perfect day trip.